We are on our way to Sparta, Konya, and Cappadocia today. It would be a long ride, but somehow we stop along the way. We will visit also Lavender Farm and other uh, tourist attractions along the way. So here, the brown thing that you can see, these are all the wheat farm here in Turkey. The wheat is ready for harvest. See? Very big farm. Wow. Imagine this wheat farm. So this is our first stop from Homokale going to Cappadocia. This is a small village here in Kuyukak. Lavender in Turkey is Lavanta. So it's a very famous place for lavender farming. You can see some shops along the way. They have uh, lot of lavender products so later I want to taste the lavender ice cream I heard that there's a lavender ice cream wow see some shops all colors lavender already so here some shops along the road you can see lavender colors so all their industries here comes from lavender flowers, lavender restaurant, lavender coffee, and you can already start seeing some of them here on the left. See, See? only a few of them. It's like smell it. it smells good Lavanta village lavender Lavender farm. Okay. Flowers. Okay, come here, everybody. Smells good. Look at the bees. At last I can touch you. <laughs> only. I can see you in the pictures only. Only you can smell them in the fabric softener. Yeah, fabric. <laughs> fabric softener. This one for our fabric softener. For washing, yes. And also for the detergent. And also for our perfume in the car also but now you can touch it for real and smell it for real you see the bees 
getting some uh, oh say so let's go on the other side okay So the blooming season of uh, lavender is between June and July only. June and July. So yes. This is the best. Time. So now it's July, first week of July. So you can see the blooming flowers of lavender. Yeah. I saw this one in YouTube, but now it's I, I'm here. I'm here. <laughs> I really like flowers. Like it's not because it's natural, right? Yeah, it's natural. I like I like the natural one. Yeah. Okay. God's creation. God made the flowers on the what day? On the third day. What is on your head? Lavender. Wow. Yes, in this area they grow rose and we are going next to Sparta which is called Rose City. Yeah, so they plant they produce a lot of roses and then they make rose oil. This is one of the leftover of the caravans rice. 15 minutes. So this is a caravan sarai. We stop over here. Caravan sarai is caravan means uh, a uh, travel in or travel lodge for the travelers during the 12th century by the caravans. And this is their stopover. Hi mommy. Okay. So there's a place for them to put their camel and also there's a room inside that they can they can stay and sleep overnight. When they travel from the Silk Road, okay, bringing their uh, their merchandise, so they travel by camels and they. Uh, stop over to this kind of uh, lodging house. They they, they call they call it caravan. So when you try to look around here, you can imagine how they travel from one place to another using their camel. We travel for many hours, and the landscape looks like this. Okay, so it's really really hard for those times, 12th century to travel there's no car during that time you will see inside what they have 
So inside here, this is a souvenir shop. The dining table inside the caravan sarai and but mommy she found something good you can sit like a caravan like mommy